What's up, nerds? Welcome to Cool Nerd Show. I'm Steve Chazza. Scott Burnett. And this is our Cool Nerd Theories video. Yep. Supergirl Theories. See if I can. Thanks for ending the way you did so we could do a theory -o, theory -o video on it. Theory video on it. Yes. Who's in the pod? Uh, what's in the box? Me the what's box. in the fucking box? So, Scott has put together some theories. I've also put together a couple theories of my own. Eerily similar but different. So they're like bizarro theories. So... Yeah. Uh, Scott, what are your theories for the Supergirl pod? So, if theories. you didn't see it, at the end of the episode, um, everything's all happy and a pod crashes down. It's a Kryptonian, Kryptonian pod. pod. I, an iPod falls out of the sky. <laughs> and she's like, who uses these anymore? Um, but she pops it open, she's like, oh my god, and it ends. So, what I was thinking, theory number one, since we have theor similar theories, I'll give my theory about it, and then you give your theory about sure. it. Sure. Um, theory one is, it's either... Her mom, Allura, or it's a message in a bottle type thing. Because in the comics, Argo City, where Supergirl's family is from, uh, survives. Uh, zor they put kind like, of just float through space. Yeah, zor put a, a like a bubble, a red weather bubble, and it survived the explosion. So I could see them sending like either Allura back or like a message in a bottle. Like, hey, we're still here. Because then Dean Kane dad is still alive in Cadmus, and then her real family is still alive in Cadmus. So she's going to be like... Who do I go save? So I kind of think it's her mom who will wake up and be like, our city's still there, our family's still alive. Or it's like, help, we're here, come save us. Um, I'm going to save my best for last. So I'm going to go with my lesser theory first. And that is that it, it could be Kandor, the bottle shrunken capital of yeah. Krypton. So in a bottle. It's basically, it's a city in a bottle, and, and I believe it was Brainiac who shrunk the city. Yeah. Um, not necessarily that it needs to be an actual person in the pod. It's just what if she just opens it's up a and it's just the city in the bottle just sitting in the pod? She's like, oh, oh, oh yeah, this man is just millions of people. Um, that's what I think it could be. Um, I don't think they'll actually bring Brainiac in and, and yeah, have him. I, I think he's think too so. big of a villain. They to gotta save him, him for Justice League anyway. But, um... I think that, that that's a possibility. We could see Brain, or Brainiac. We could see Candor, the shrunken. I would think that was really Kryptonian funny. city. That would just be really funny to see in the pod. Like, <gasps> Somebody got me. I don't a know where they would go with that though. Is the only how thing. do you like unshrink it and yeah. then there's a new city? And then it's like a whole different storyline. Where it's like, what are we gonna do with this? Where do we put Feed this? Them. <laughs> like like yeah. it's fish. Like <laughs> yeah. <no. laughs> Anybody have Kryptonian food we could sprinkle <laughs> on the top of this? Um, my other theory. It could also be true since Cadmus is a thing. It's a Superman clone, and it's Superboy. Um, this way, they can get out of casting Superman, and everybody can shut up about it. Like, where's and Superman? They put Superboy in it. And then it's, it's Superboy, so he looks like Clark Kent, but not. And because they all the talk with Cadmus, you know, Cadmus, Cadmus, I, you're, we're gonna see Superboy sooner rather than later. So it could be she could be like, my cousin's in it. He's gonna wake up and he's gonna be like, who am I? Like that kind of thing. Yeah. So. Either that or Argo City. Those are my two theories. Here's my big one. What I really think it's going to be. And I think it's Power Girl. See, like similar. Superboy, Power Girl, Bottled City, Bottled City. So that's why they're Bizarro theories. They're pretty I, much the same, just different. I really think it's Power Girl because we had that crossover thing with, with the Flash. And Power Girl comes from a different universe. And there's no Supergirl in the Flash's universe. So she could have gotten like caught... In some kind of storm, whatever, something. So you think it's from the DCEU universe and she's coming back, but she's going to stay? <clears throat> the, thing with, the thing with Power Girl is, in the comics, Power Girl, Super Girl Superman dis discovers Power Girl yeah. in a pod, just like his own. She attacks him, right, or something like that? Like no, like, well, he opens it up and it's a fully grown naked well, woman, which is Power Girl, yeah. in the pod. And I believe that's in Earth 1. Not in Earth 2. But she's from Earth 2. Yeah, she's so, from Earth 2. So, what's not to say that that Power Girl could not be... From another Earth. Exactly. And then she, and then that crash lands. Also, Supergirl is a very kind of like... Power, woman power show. Woman feminist type show. What better than having two female heroes yeah. on the show? They kind of have Alex, though. Well, all right. What better than having three? Bizarro. She's kind of good now. She's yeah, but she's not. She's not a regular. regular. Yeah, 
I don't know if they're going to be superhero si- superhero sidekick Power Girl. I really think it it's going to be Power Girl. Yeah, I, th- I think it's too similar, and then they have like they're both like super strong. So who's to say that they're just, that would be overkill? They really have the same powers. I know they're going to. That's overkill. I don't know. I think I think I think be good. And Martian Manhunter, Power Girl, Supergirl, yeah. and Martian Manhunter. Yep. No, nope. nobody's gonna stop anything. Yep. Although Superboy, but Superboy is less powered than I would say Supergirl. Yeah. yeah, yeah. I he can't fly. He doesn't have heat vision. He can jump. He can jump real good, and he can really punch high. real hard. So he's like Supergirl and Superman light. So um, I think they could go. Another theory that we've been getting: Crypto the dog. Don't mm. think that's gonna happen though. Yeah. No. Because that'd just be really stupid. Yep. Although, if the show does Supergirl. jump the shark like that, you really gotta go with it. Supergirl also has a, a pet horse, a pet cat, and a pet monkey. Really? Yes. Super monkey, huh? Could have could be all any of those. Don't think it's going to. Or all of them. Because I oh, that'd be terrible. <laughs> Super be monkey so, horse. They're just all like babies. I was gonna say mashed into one oh. mutant being. <laughs> no. <laughs> That's gross. A, a super, uh, what was it from BBS? A super deformity or whatever, <laughs> Kryptonian deformity. Um, but I really do. I think it's Power Girl. That's that's what I'm doubling down on. I, if I had to pick one out of the two theories, I would say uh, Alora or the Bottled City. Well, because she can make my family still alive. Because both of her families are going to be still alive. Those are our theories. Please tell us your theories yep. in the comments below. Um, if you haven't already, like, favorite, and subscribe, and check out all of our other videos on Cool Nerd Show, and we'll see you over there. Thanks for watching. For more nerd videos like this one, be sure to subscribe to our channel and follow us on social media.